Welcome back to CK2, where our current goal is to capture all five Catholic holy sites. Currently, we have four, and we are about to capture our fifth one over here at Jerusalem, which for some reason, Jerusalem siege down right now by the Sheik of Acre. Don't know why he's doing that. Um, not really an issue of mine. Um, I also wanted to know how this war against Pisa was going. Um, 71% in the favor of Sultan Hubert. Hopefully they win that, and hopefully the French also take Portugal. Um, beyond that, uh, let's just get into the game. I want to quickly imprison the Sheik of Sikland, Sheik Sikland of Friesland. Hopefully that just goes through nice and easy. Please. Thank you. Excellent. He has been thrown in prison. And we can just get right into what I want to really do. I want to begin the first war against the Abbasids. Now, I've been giving a lot of thought to this. And it's going to be either Alexandria or Damietta. Because Sinai is just too hard to conquer. And to be honest... I don't know if I want Damietta, Yeesh, one or the other. And they're both in the same little sea tile, so it wouldn't really matter, and Alexandria is just closer. But I'm still scared that I wouldn't be able to conquer them. I will admit, though, that Sinai is like a couple sea tiles away. I don't know how the sea tile thing works. Ugh. All I know is that the Abbasids are really weak right now and are spread pretty thin. And I feel like feel like it wouldn't be impossible to take it. Can I do a conquest? No, I can't. That would make my life a little bit easier. Um, you know what? No. We are not going for Damietta or Alexandria. We're going to go right for Sinai again. It's the pipe. Our supply is completely horrible, and I feel like it's impossible to take Sinai, but we got to. This is the only way. The only way. And, well, time to go for broke, I guess. And, oh yeah, let's issue declaration for penance, too. I forgot to do that last time. <laughs> well, right, right after... We declare this holy war. Let's just quickly go and ask the Pope for forgiveness. Yeah, just normal things. Why is the Umid army just sitting there in Sicily? Shouldn't they have, like, bigger issues to com to accomplish? Like, defeating the French army that is just roaming in Portugal right now? Hmm. Who knows? I will say one thing, though. While the Umeads are distracted, this is the perfect time to... Oh my goodness. I want my army, please. I don't want my advisor, my political advisor. I want these troops to go over to Syracuse. I then want these folk to then meet up over here in Tobruk. Actually, no, let's be honest here. Go to Cyrenesia first. And hopefully all of these guys were told to move in. If anything, these more northern guys weren't told. So let's just quickly make sure they were all told. Let's go to Syracuse. Here we go. Let's unpause for the first time. And God has shown me the light. Make some progress doing penance. Cool. Wonderful. Some Miltech or something. Cool, 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 cool. What is this? Um, no, never. Not doing that, please. That would be pretty bad for me to implement gavel kind at this point. Let's keep things moving, though. Hopefully, um, Serbia or someone doesn't declare an excommunication war. That would not be too nice of them. And I would be pretty weak to it at the moment. I doubt someone would try to do something like that. But you never know. Someone might go a little crazy and think that they can do something that they probably shouldn't do. And they'll probably get their butts kicked for it later on, but I'm not going to focus on that right now. I'd much rather focus on trying to get these troops over here as fast as possible. 
Now, I think I'm just going to siege down Sinai basically as quickly as possible. I'm not even going to really bother with Egypt. I'm going to basically go in a line. I'm going to ignore almost everything in Egypt, <laughs> hopefully. Let's rank up. Just give me some more, I think maybe prestige happens, I don't know. Expose and denounce him publicly, giving me a reason to arrest him. Um, sure, just threaten him. Praise be God. Um, to be honest, we can move over to Tobruk now. I doubt, ooh, an Abbasid army. Going towards where? Wait, is that an Abbasid army? No, that's... No, 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 that is the Abbasid army. And, and an Abbasid army. Don't know which. Could, could care less, really, about which, but... We're gonna see... Let's gather these guys up for now. Let's put them on the boats. Let's get them over to Dubrok. Hopefully we can get as many soldiers as possible. To be honest, we might actually have some trouble here. It is a large Abbasid army that seems prepared to fight me. Um, apparently Amalfi just got a new do doge. Ooh, I don't know why I clicked on that. I could use more good men. I can't give out land, preferably. Uh, a battle might start. I would hate to see those troops perish. Eesh. They're, are they not moving to the same area? Is he going to be able to escape? I cannot imagine that he's going to be able to escape right now. If he is, that's amazing. But... That's not going to happen, right? Probably not. I can't imagine it will. Let's hope for those guys to hop in. Come on. Apparently, they're not going to try and attack me. They're going to do something else? Question mark. I mean, I hope they do. Makes my life 20 times easier. And I know what I'm going to immediately face. Apparently, it's 8,000 people who have a pretty mean streak about them. Can't believe I just said that. Um, let's keep things moving, though, before they do decide to try and fight me. Cool. I would like for a rebellion to kick up. That would be nice. Grand Vizier. Let's see here. Um, this guy doesn't like me, but he's going to be forced to go into enemy territory and try and do something about the Abbasid real fast. So that's just bad news for him, I guess gonna have to help me haha -ha. really no one okay now they're all starting to come in but they're taking their sweet time I'm telling you the foul jester apparently some rude comments are being spewed out um, there's a nice army over there but it's taking its sweet time as well what is this Abbasid fleet doing? Who knows? Make it so... Vermin Doi becomes Berber. Oh no. Uh... Leave it to chance. I don't want to make them Berber, please. <laughs> that sounds like a horrific idea. Cool, 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 cool. Things are happening. Um, I'll just gather these guys up for now and put them on boats. Because now he should be able to launch an invasion into Zykra. And hope that nothing bad happens. I really hope nothing bad happens, at least. Um, Zykra can hold 16,000 troops. Go ahead and see if your plan works. I doubt the bastard child will cause any trouble. Um, just go with that. I'm cool with that for now. Group them up. Send them over. Apparently there's a large number of troops coming in. Let's get over there as soon as possible to pick those guys up. Um, let's see here. Master of the Hunt. Alright, I need to pick someone who kind of hates me. There we go. 
and another one, High Almoner, again, someone who hates me. Cool, 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 cool. And a Commander. Uh, yeah, that'll be fine. Damage, yeah, I, I don't really care about those negatives. If we lose the battle, I blame it on him. That's all I have to say about that. Um, oof, I don't like that number. Combine, split, can you get on the boat? You can get on the boat. Never mind, you are perfectly fine after all. I'll probably just, blessed but be his name, I'll probably just send this guy into Siwa and then El Baraton. I'll have to remember the hotkey for uh, telling them which direction to specifically go to though. He goes control. Maybe shift. Yes, it is shift. Okay, cool. So he will specifically go down that route. That's a little neat tidbit that I learned. Take shift and just click on the province provinces that you want them to go down. Uh, and then they will go down those specific provinces or counties. Definitely not provinces. Definitely counties. But it's good when you need them to go down a specific way. Allows you to knock them down pretty good. Wait, these guys can just... No, they can't. Okay, let's grab them. One of them needs to go on a boat. Take this guy down to Tobruk. And we'll probably have these guys go all the way down and take El Iskanderia or whatever. I'm going to try and avoid to go off the... Oh my, I'm serving. That's not a good sign. That is a poor sign indeed. Okay, split. Send these guys over to Al Ikansiridia, or whatever it is called. Um, call for my court physician at once. Might as well. Seek treatment for illness. That's never a good sign. Oh, yeah, I have great pox, don't I? Eek. I hate that. Let's take shift again. Go to Siwa. Go there. Then go to Al Melitis. That should be fine. Let's grab these guys. This will be the last army. Uh, my life is in your hands. As long as you know what you're doing, please don't do something bad. I actually feel better. That's a good sign. Okay, so now we got a somewhat big army over here in Al Melitis. I shall ask her how well it is going. Cool, I might as well. What is this? They're going to marry, except I knew she could do it. Concentrate humble, cool. Bunch of weird stuff, I guess. Uh, actually, let's just send you over there for now. I don't want you to go anywhere too worrisome. Uh, let's pick these last guys up, and then we'll combine the other two armies into one assault squad. And that should work out pretty nicely. Or not, they could just leave. Yeah, no, see, this is why you need shift, people. This is why, indeed, you need shift. Shift, click, click. Cool. Now, where did they send that last army? <laughs> that should have been a question I asked a long time ago. Apparently, they're over here, not doing really anything else right now. At least that's good for me. That's 6,000. They just grabbed an 8,000. That means that they have a crap ton more troops left. Cool. I don't like this idea anymore. <laughs> I hate this idea, actually. This is a bad idea. Okay, so the Pisa War ended, and they just took Pisa. Are you kidding me? What did they take in that war? Where is the Duchy of Pisa? You gotta be joking, right? They didn't even take anything, did they? Burgundy, what did you grab in Pisa? Where, where is Pisa? Pisa is that. They took this. Okay, wonderful. Exactly what I wanted to hear. I am not angry with that circumstance at all. Why would I be angry? I'll be playing as this man. Okay. He doesn't look too old, I guess. But now I know that there is a huge Abbasid army lurking about somewhere, and I'm probably going to get 
completely eliminate or destroyed, not eliminated. Let's go over there. Let's go over there. Let's go over there and then over there. Okay. That'll be my little train over to uh, Sinai for now. And things are looking pretty good. My reputation is ruined. I don't know why it would not already be. She is an excellent learner. Saddle my horse. You know, normal things. Okay, so that's been taken. That is awesome. Uh, I don't really want these two to group up, so let's let them, like, make it most of the way there. Then we'll send this guy over. Cool. Um, shift. I will fulfill my duties. Go there. Then go... What is this? God's blessings upon the... What is it? Donate to charity. Cool. Boom. Then boom to that place. Very well sent him in. We are glad for your visit. What did I say wrong? Cool. This time it will not excite... Oh my goodness, escape me. <sighs> Apparently words are escaping me. Um... What else should I do? Give me a moment. Oh yeah, I needed to donate to charity real fast. Where is that again? Yes, intrigue. I'm gonna go over here to donate to charity. Donate to charity. Boom. I only did my do duty. Converius, or whatever his name is. Probably it's not even his name, to be honest. Please join me at my court. Sure. I guess I'm okay with that. Playing a game of military strategy. What kind of stats do I need? Um, mm. Is there an intrigue one? No, there is not. Let's just pick Marshall then. Marshall will help. I won't give up. That is the correct way to do things, if I must say so. Uh, what is this? Negotiate with a person. What is this about? Eleven Diplo. Or actually, I would just click that anyways. How big of an army do they have in my territory at the moment? That is a pretty weak army. They must have lost the battle against a vassal. And then I have no idea. They're probably going to go down and try to siege down Vermindoy. But I have my ways of dealing with such things. That is too bad. Hopefully we can just continue to siege this stuff down nicely. Nothing bad happens, hopefully. Um, yes, things are looking good for now. We're about to get a few victories here. Hopefully they're good enough that they can just surrender. Can my spy master never bring me good news? What? Uh... I won't tolerate blackmail, I won't tolerate blackmail, I won't tolerate, okay, there's a lot of, I won't tolerate. Okay, that was a lot of people, that would have been a lot of gold, <laughs> but I'm not going to tolerate it. Another Hindu revolt has broken out, so hopefully that will stop the Abbasids from doing a whole lot. Um, they still have 58,000 troops, so that's not nice. Um, apparently, something just finished up in Egypt. Delicacies from the far west. War and disease are not the only things the Aztecs have brought with them from that place, their distant homeland. Their diet includes several strange plants that supposedly that are supposedly edible, and many of these are now enjoyed as exotic delicacies in courts across Europe and the Middle East. A passing fad, it will never catch on. Cool. Guess that'll keep us fed? I guess. Um, these two should fall pretty quickly. How about the rest of these? That one's going to take a while. And this one's already completely collapsing at the seams. So, things aren't going too bad, I guess. Apparently, that was another fleet of something. Hopefully, they just stay away. Um, some of my armies are getting pretty small right now. I don't like the idea of that. But nothing bad's going on, I guess. As long as things continue to go my way, I'm not going to have that many of issues. 
Probably could get a white piece right now if I really wanted to. Yeah, I could get a white piece. That's good information to know. Are they actually sieging down Vermin Doi? Or are they about to... Um, actually, I don't see their armies anywhere. That is kind of scary. Ooh, I should actually be shutting the gates right now. I did not see that one. Shut the gates. Seal it. I don't see their military stationed about. This will be the end of the episode. And currently we are facing against the Abbasids, who have a very strong military. And against our not too large military. We are at 45%, but it's only a matter of time before they eventually kick my butt. So we just need to hope that certain, certain things go our way. Such as the Abbasids just completely messing up where they need to send their military. Beyond that, Iberia is still a very, very big mess. With the Umeids and the Aztecs trying to remain as powerful in the region as they possibly can. This does also include North Africa a little bit. But the Umeids just don't have any influence there. And it's really just the Aztecs trying to remain dominant, I guess. And they're not doing a very good job at it, though. Beyond that, we have the Byzantines and the Abbasids. Uh, the Byzantines, in particular, have not been doing a whole lot at the moment. They've been remaining very stable, unlike many other empires around them. Um, and that's really it I have to say about them. The Abbasids, on the other hand, are currently fighting a war with me, and also have been quite a bit... It, quite a few issues with their Hindu territories out in the Far East. And they may not be able to hold those if they continually have to fight wars on both ends of their empire. Um, Rostislavl, on the other hand, is growing and growing and growing. They continually try and gain more influence out here in the West, as well as continuing to push out further east and a little bit to the north. They're really just expanding, or trying to expand on all fronts, and they have even declared war against the Byzantines in an attempt to try and push down to the south. Will this work out? Maybe not, especially since they're defending against the Byzantines and are not actually on the offensive. I do think they'll win against the Byzantines pretty easily, just because they are huge, but who knows? Sviad is also doing many different things. Um, they are trying to slowly integrate this region over here, the Scandinavia region, and also probably consolidate Iceland and probably these other people over here in Finland. Of course, Ross Level will be trying to stop them in doing that, though. Kazaria has been basically isolated within this steppe region. And Bashkuria is making sure that that remains permanent. Beyond that, the Uyghurs are just having issues upon issues upon issues, and are probably not going to be able to expand for a good long time. Tibet has also collapsed, but still is looking mighty. A is slowly consolidating the region as it should be. And that is pretty much it for now. Goodbye.